Anything? Looks a bit treacherous. I think we should keep on moving. Oh, come on, where's the daredevil in you, huh? Let's document it. I can take a few shots. This is amazing! If what they're saying on the news is correct, this could be the biggest natural disaster in history in a matter of days. That's why we've got to get out of Dodge. Come on, put a few photos. I mean, they just said it might happen in a few days. Yeah, and I bet that's what they said at Pompeii, too. All right, come on, let's go. There's no signal. We better get back to the car where it's safe. Get it. It's not starting. Greg, come on! Get out. Get out now! It won't open! It won't open! I can't get out! I can't get out! I can't get out! described as a megastorm. Dr. Becker, a researcher at the NSSL, wants that these storms could become more commonplace in the wake of global warming. Some of his working theories on these storms from research and similar in Iceland have so far been dismissed by rival experts. Another storm has been forecast in the coming days. The previous one was far more aggressive than experts had believed. Two people have been reported dead. Dr. Becker warns that further storms could prove unpredictable and potentially a severe threat to life. Come on, come on, answer. Sorry. Oh my god, you scared the Didn't mean to stop me. you. Oh, I just think it's this storm has gotten me a little shaky. And I seem to have something wrong with my car, and I can't get a hold of my husband to come out here and fix it. I could take a look. I don't want to trouble you. You know, I just live about 10 minutes up the road. It's just that uh, I can't seem to get a hold of my husband to come out here and save me. <laughs> What's the matter? What the devil's here? 
Hey, how about I drop you off on my way home? How oh, about that? You know, that's okay. I appreciate the offer, but um, no, thank you. Well, it's only ten minutes away. It's no problem. Yeah, you know, I'm just gonna wait for my husband. I'm gonna get, try and give him a call again, actually. Thank you, though. Are you sure? Yeah. Thank okay. you. Okay. breathes upon us here most sweetly. Have a good time. Yeah. Thanks. And we'll go again some other time. Yeah, I actually, I had fun. I'm not usually, usually like to be adventurous type. Yeah, well, that's why we practice indoors. Take it outdoors and then we'll scale Everest. <laughs> sure. Yeah, we've got to stay away from the mountains near Rough Rock Lake. Like, did you hear about that fellow getting vaporized by life? But yeah, I read about that. Oh, that's shocking. Stop it. That's awful. Anyway, do you and your sister still good to host tomorrow? Yeah, um, well, I'll text Sally and Donald that I come in. Um, Mike and Charlie can't make it. Well, Charlie's a twat. Sounds no loss then. <laughs> yeah, my parents will be leaving, I think, um, early afternoon, so I'll just text you. Well, me and Paulie will sort out booze. What do you like? It's too strong. Girls drink. Mate, it's 2022. You can't say things like that, pig. Well, what do you want, then? Something like freeway or like jean takes or something. Oh, like strength. <laughs> right, if I didn't like you so much, I'd cut your balls off. Mm. Not. Not here. Not in the car, like, just get that out of your head. Just get me so worked up. Not when my parents are 30 yards away. Yeah. Do you want mine to be right? Yeah. Thank you. What? For being patient and. No, it's fine. Go on, a cold shower, sort myself out. What's that up with me? Look, I don't, despite what Paulie might say about me, I'm not a player, right? And okay. I'm in it for the long haul. I don't want to ruin this by rushing it. You just got to decide. Yeah. Oh, I'll see you tomorrow. I'm gonna keep it PG for it. Hi. Right. Yeah, and they said on the news to expect some heavy thunder. They've even told us to warn in, stay indoors. It's a load of crock, isn't it? Who was in the car? Spanish Inquisition. No, it's Mastermind, Dad's edition. So? Just a friend, whatever. Mm. 
No tuny then. Yeah, it's good. Looks all right. <laughs> Look, when your mother and I go on this weekend, we don't want any shenanigans. Shouldn't it be you two I'm worried about causing the shenanigans? No, yeah, well, but we've got plenty of experience, haven't we? And we pay the bills. I don't want to come back here and find this place trashed. Okay. What are you reading? Oh, it's a report on the lightning the other day. It says that we could be getting in for more incurrences, um, sometimes even more dangerous. <laughs> Some crackpot in here says that uh, he thinks the lightning is tuned to the electric current in the human body. Should you even be going away then, if it's that dangerous? Can't you just stay here? Look, your mother will lose her shit if we don't go away. We booked this trip ages ago. It's a fairly safe journey and it's only two hours on the motorway. I, I, I just don't want you going and then the roads are going to be closed and then you can't find a way back if something happens. Your mother's not going to complain if we get stuck in the resort. Yeah. Just drive safe. Oh, many United loss. Right, Dad, you know we have the internet. I could have told you that last night. Hmm. Isn't it past your bedtime? What time is it? 10.30. 10.30. Yeah, I'm not 12 anymore, Dad. Seriously. Avante. Look him. Love you too. Bye. Bye, love. Thou hast howled away twelve winters. Don't you realize no one's coming for you? This is your life now. They've already stopped talking about you in the news. All they're talking about is this lightning and how everyone has to stay indoors. Didn't even mention you. Temperance was a delicate wench. <laughs> You've used all the milk. Can I have a yogurt then? Mm, beg me. Oh, you're such a dickhead. One well, then, but you want me another? Yeah, I'll get you a luxurious one with gold. Sprinkles on top. Sounds good. That was rank. It's our day. Why do you think I'm having cereal? Oh, my God. Oh, so, you all set for later? Yeah. Okay, the boys are definitely coming. Is Sally and the boyfriend still coming? Yes. <laughs> and what about? Oh, yeah, um, Holly and Sean said they were going to do a booze. Okay. okay. Well, as long as we don't get any cheap cider like no. in college. No, we told them to get G&T. Good. Obviously. Good. <laughs> <laughs> so you're contemplating how much is it going to cost me? <laughs> Nothing, Mum. I know what you two are like. What are you scheming? No, I just, um, I think we're going to watch some films with Sally, aren't we? She's going to hang around. What movie? It's like a disaster movie about fire tornadoes. You know, when I was your age, we'd usually have to be drunk before we could watch a silly movie about a killer doll. Then we'd scared ourselves so much that we couldn't sleep. <laughs> Creepy dolls are so the early noughties. <laughs> <laughs> Who's had all the milk? Dad. Dad. Mm. Black tea it is, then. <laughs> when we're gone, right, no boys, no parties, no boosting, but for a couple of beers in the fridge, and that's your limit, ladies. OK. okay. Thanks, Mum. She still thinks we're kids, wouldn't she? But don't tell her, because she'll plan it. <laughs> Kiss the slice. Right.
Are you telling me that your mother's ready? <laughs> no. <laughs> Look, I want to get away soon. I want to get off before those bloody storm clouds come in. So, what are you two doing today? I'm uh, just movies with Sally. Look, sell some drinks or something, eh, girls? Have a nice time. Oh. Alright, that's will get us an extra couple of bottles. You know, I'm still working on 1980s time. Could buy a house button yeah. for that. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, what do you mean? No, that's what you get for being a milk tea. Oh. Right, so Mum and Dad will be gone in a couple of hours, and then we need to get ready, because then the boys are coming. <laughs> hey, what's it? Nothing. It's just like. Stuff. All right, well, you don't need to feel any pressure, right? It doesn't have to be this weekend. I know. It's just with everything that happened with yeah. my ex and stuff, mm. I just I don't want him to get, like, put off me or anything. Mm. Look, if he does, it's not worth it, all right? But I don't think he will. Okay. <laughs> Besides, he can take care of himself for the time being. Choke his chicken to his heart's content. That's grim. Here's <laughs> <laughs> a bit. <laughs> rain soon, you know. Did you hear about the thunder and the news? Yeah, that's why we're going to make sure the weekend. We'll be fine here until the bus comes. Yeah, but how long? An hour. I know. We get an early start. <laughs> <laughs> Promise me something. What? No silly drunken dancing. When have I ever drunken danced? Uh, my sister's wedding, prom, literally every single night at student union. Okay, fine. I'm taken. Thunder really freaks me out. Bloody hell, love. You turned the water mains off before you pulled the sink out. Very funny. Could you help? Don't worry, girls. We'll be back. Even though your mum's packing up for a migration. Yeah, you paid the mortgage off, though, aren't you? We'll be fine. Oh, did you hear that, Di? That's how little and that is. Mm. I'm not a kid. Oh, you'll always be my baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay. If there's anything you need, all right, I've got this, my fifth limb. So don't be thinking that you can't call. I can fuck you. Okay. I'll oh. see you, Mum. Bye, Mum. Love you. Bye, Dad. Bye, Dad. Bye. 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 I want to beat Bye. this stall from. Bye. Bye. All right. So I reckon we get some drinks and we start getting ready. Oh.
Thou hast slept well. Help me! Help me! Silence! One more word and I will chide thee! Just let me go. I won't tell anybody, I promise. Just a few more days. And I'll set you free. Why are you doing this? Because I can. Please. Because no one's going to stop me. Please, just let me go. I'm begging you. Girls, how could you do that? It's quite simple. Strangely therapeutic. It takes great patience to do my work. To put a cut precisely where it needs to be. You're a fucking maniac. Afternoon, girls. Hey, hey, there. Oh, how are you? Easy, sweet time. Yeah, we were circling around waiting for your green light. Look what we got. Um, Sally and her boyfriend are running late. They couldn't catch the bus, so. Well, we didn't come here to hang around with those two, did we? Here's to a Thank delightful you. weekend in the country. <laughs> Cheers. So, when are Donald and Sally actually going to get here? You know what, I don't even know. My phone's been playing up as well, so I can't even get hold of them. Why did you park so far away? It's easy to get out. <laughs> Sean can't parallel park. <laughs> He will hit anything and everything he can. Cars, bikes, people, <clears throat> small children. Yeah, laugh it up, dickhead. 
How are you getting home? Right, on your children's day. Right, I'd like to propose a proper toast. To loved ones and good times. And to Meg. No, seriously, even though you're the youngest, you're the most grounded. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. So you've got a jacuzzi? Yeah, why? And you fancy it? Okay. <laughs> Ugh, no signal. Probably because we're in the middle of nowhere, don't know. Maybe the storm's messing with the connection. Jesus. Those clouds are getting really close. Just think we're safe here. I can feel that one. I'm scared. I'm sure, it's nothing to worry about. Are you crazy? What? Silly sod. <laughs> I'm slightly worried. That storm seems to be getting aggressive and it's getting closer. Well, I think we're safe, love. These modern cars are lightning proof, I think. Lightning proof? They tell you that on the forecourt, did they? No, I think I saw it on Top Gear once. Did you see that? Worse. The right hand wiper doesn't work very well. I keep telling you to replace it. I'll get to it. How are you enjoying the log cabin in the garden, by the way? Log oh, cabin. The one you said you were going to build five years ago. I think the last update on that was I'll get round to it. You're not winding me up, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Twenty-five years and counting, darling. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, we look great. Thanks. Hey. Oh, I'm fine. I'm just a bit worried about like Donald and Sally because I've not heard from them like, all night. It's... Well, but, like, maybe like, the parents are just being strict on them. It's been kind of mad lately, hasn't it? Like, all these streets locking them down. I'm just worried that they're out there and stuck in the storm. Oh, shit. That was nearer. What do you think we should just check the weather across? It's a big... I think... I don't think we should be in here. I think we should go out. Okay. Just relax. We're here to have a good time. Yeah, just relax. Be okay. What about if Donald and Sally are stuck in it? Like, I'm going to get struck by lightning. <laughs> Surely. That's not funny. Well, I'm going to go and check on them anyway.
She's just worried about a friend, that's all. Yeah, but she's making a big thing about going in. She's not making yeah. a big thing, well, just she leave did. her alone. Oh shit, Nick! <laughs> Holy, it's not funny! It is a little no, bit. No, it's not! <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Nick. Hello, Nick. Oh, Mum, Jack, are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, they'll be fine. Don't be silly. Hey. Don't be dramatic now, okay? That's my job. <laughs> yeah? Fine. Okay. Fine. Should we find cover somewhere? Where? Look, we're just under an hour away. It's pretty bad out there. I thought they said it was fine to be out on the roads. Well, technically they didn't say that. They actually said, well, you shouldn't leave your house unless it's an emergency, and you were coming in from the east. Maybe we should turn back. Look, it's only supposed to get rough in a couple more days. We're almost through this now. Watch the road, love. Pull up, pull up the road. Shit! Watch. to move. Did you see what happened back there? Christ almighty. I think we're by Riley's farm. The house is a couple of fields over. Okay. Bloody tire's blown. Look, the fields are out in the open. It's too dangerous. I'm going to say it's better to be out here than under one of these trees or stuck in this tin box. Could we not just stay in the car? Look out, die! Oh my god, there is no signal! I just want to call the girls. I can't get a signal. Hello. The house is something. Get to it, perhaps we can use their phone. Oh, come on, come on. Come on, love. Calm down. It's gonna be alright. Have you caught me? Yeah. It's gonna be alright. Yeah. You've always been there. Really, these things are me, and I've got my glasses and you won't. <laughs> okay, let's go. Right. Let's get to watch. Okay. Right. It's okay. I've got the map. Look. Come on, Bernie.
just seems so suicidal no matter what you think. Yeah, it might be his finest clothes. Have you said anything on the radio, man? Nothing has changed. Can we just go back in the hot tub now? I can still see the clouds above. Yeah, I can still see some lightning crackling inside. Mom and Dad are okay. There's no phone signals. We're not gonna know anything. Just stop overthinking it, all right? Hey, Meg. They'll be fine. All right, what do we do? Why don't we go back out to the jacuzzi and chill the hell out? It's meant to be a party, guys. Bunch of sad sacks. Stop freaking out. Mm. Okay. No, it's fine. I'm here. Yeah. So. Sorry, I don't like give you what you want sometimes. It's just I have, like I have to just take so it slow. No, there's no rushing, right? You know I like it a lot. Yeah. Mm. I don't know Cottage, southeast. What are you doing there? There was an accident on the road. Mom, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. All right. I'm still a little shaken. Look, I'll check back in with you later. Are you girls all right? Yeah, we're fine. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come and get you. No. It's dangerous. No, I'm gonna come and get you and Dad now, okay? Send me the address. Just leave it. Meg, listen to me for once in your life. Okay, it is not safe to be out on the road. All right, I'll call back. On you later. I love you. Love you too. Will you take me to come find my mum and Dad? Yeah, yeah. They've been in an accident and we need to go. We need to go now. Corin, 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 listen to me. Stop listening. Mum and Dad have been in an accident, okay? What? It's all right. They're fine, but I need you to stay here. Be safe, and I'm going to go get Mum. Okay. Just stay there. All right, okay. Shit. All right. I don't understand. Hold her. Can you go get a car ready for me, please? Okay. I'll go get her. Okay. Well, in the meantime, 
We've got the hot tub to ourselves. Oh, it doesn't matter what's going on with your weird sister right now, it's fine. I don't call her weird. She's causing a lot of drama tonight. Yeah, well, she's been through a lot and you don't know half of it, okay? Well, how would I know what's going on with her? Give me some. Polly, get out. It's just a bit lightning. Polly, that's getting close. Polly, get out now! Polly, get out of the top, Polly! Do you think we've got a warning? Okay, so that's like the last surge has passed or something. Well, it look, looks clear over there. There's nothing in the clouds. Just go. Oh, should we, should we go that way then? Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're, go, we're gonna get your parents first, and then once once we got them, we get the fuck out of this danger okay, zone. Yeah. 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 Okay, all right, let's go. Let's go. Yeah. He's dead. He's dead. We've got to get inside. Sally. Sally, come here. Get us out of the car now. Sally, get out. dead. <laughs> he called his parents! <laughs> he called his parents! After you called the police, he called his parents! They need to know! Okay. Oh, they need to know! <laughs> I can try, uh, drive if you want me to. No! No! I've got it! I'm good! Good. You know we're driving right into the eye of this storm. Yeah, I know, but we just need to go and go with parents and just pick them up and then get out of here, okay? Just focus on that. 
I mean, the storm's got to be like 10 miles at least. I reckon we just we just get them both and we just to just get out of the danger zone, okay? Yeah? I reported this last week and they said the lightning was knocking out electronics. And like, depending on the proximity, it's working like an EMP. I thought it was bullshit, man. Please help me. Please get me out of here. Okay. By providence divine, how on earth did you wind up in here? Please, don't. <laughs> I shall be pinched to death. Put away the knife. I have to be careful. I've already been attacked by one intruder tonight. He's lying. You're lying. The lightning. We have to get out of here. Do you know who else has been struck by lightning? My husband died in this tonight. You really don't need to worry about lightning anymore. What? Why? I mean, you were trespassing. It was self-defense. Run! Get out of here! Get out of here! How didst thou escape? Causing it. Mother well, Nature buy it back. Yeah, Dad mentioned uh, this story yesterday in the paper. Yeah. What's the story? It, it was a theory about one of the storms that the lightning tunes to the current of the human body or something. That sounds impossible. People have been struck by lightning a lot more recently, aren't they? Mm, this is the second storm in days. Why this is haunting? It is far worse than what we've been experiencing until now. I could not. I'm sorry about Polly. I should have got him out of there. 
should have got him out of there. I should not. I should have got him out of there. Sean, it was a freak of nature, all right? No, I should. I should have got him out of there. I should have got him out of there. Paul is dead. <laughs> I don't think it's safe to drive anymore. We should um. We should head out on foot on the backfields. These are not natural events. They strengthen from strange to stranger. All lost to prayers. To prayers all lost. Uh, Meg, just don't look, okay? What just stay, just stay over there, okay? What is it? Jesus. 
such she said she was in a house and they left her so she must go she must go there so they must have happened she went no i know you, you said it sounded weird but we just need to find the house and she might be in there <laughs> yeah okay <laughs> Sean. Sean. You didn't make it. Sean. 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 Find the house. We need to go and find Mum. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna go. We're gonna get Mum. Okay. And I need you. I need you to be strong. Okay. I need you with me. Okay. Okay. Yeah? <laughs> okay. You ready to go? Yeah. Shelter. 
Sir, and you really need to be more sure. Okay. Is that all right? Let's try that. To try the blood. Okay. Okay. No, wait, to the car. All right, well, if someone comes back while they're in there, then we'll just explain. Okay, right? okay. Just go, just go. Come on. Looking for shelter from the storm. healing. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when I was younger, um, the wounds always seemed to heal like faster, you know. And, um, Dad goes there. <laughs> and then when I got older and he stopped, <laughs> like, it just seemed to hurt a bit more. and I just think it's going to be even harder. The reality of what's happened and... <laughs> How do we do this? <laughs> Together. Is anyone there? What do you think's happening? Does it like hurt or is it like someone dangerous? What do you know? What should we do? Everybody's locked. Should we go in? I think we should go in. Jesus, Corinne. What? No one is opening. Yeah? Yeah, okay. Go, go, go. Okay. Go, 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 just go. Oh my 
to get out of here really quickly. <laughs> the guy who owns this place is fucking crazy. Oh. He kidnapped me. If he finds you here, he'll kill us all. How long has he been gone? Oh, I I've got no idea. He, he, I heard him head out. I don't know where he is. Alright, well. Quick! Okay. Well, people have been dying left and right. If he's out there, he might have been struck. Oh, I hope so. I want that bastard to die. Yeah, we need to get these off, please. Just go, please. I saw a knife. I'm gonna go and grab it, okay? I'll be back. What happened? There was another woman here before me. He said he was going to replace her with me. He grabbed me from behind. Mm. He put something over my face. He knocked me out. And then I woke up tied up in this room. Oh, thank God you came. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. It's okay. After you, oh, no. Oh, he showed me some vial. Horrible pictures of what? Other girls. Here before me, I recognised a couple from posters around town. After you, Val. Oh, I. We found his body. I should have told you. I'm so sorry, Meg. I just wanted to keep you safe. Yeah. What happened with your father was just all so sudden. Oh, he's here. Quick. Thank you, sir. Come on, quick. Come on, come on, come on, come on, just come. We should all go together. We have to get through him first, okay? Yeah? Nice. Oh. oh no. What do we do? What do we do? Let's hide, let's hide. Okay. Meg. Meg. What? Look. 
of a storm. It's coming back this way. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> I I'd have guests I'd have cleaned. The spirit torments me. Oh! is empty and all the devils are here. The hours come. You know what I'm going to enjoy. Making you choose. Who dies first and who gets to watch the suffering? The God of Thunder calls to me once again. Perhaps he wants a sacrifice. It's not enough. I'm going to need more blood! <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Give me thy hand. I do begin to have bloody thoughts. <laughs>
fitting. Oh. 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 That's it. Oh. <laughs> Peekaboo cherub. <laughs> she begged me to let her go. I told her she'll just be mine for the weekend, and then I'll let her go back to her daddy. I filleted her from ear to ear before the end of Sunday. <laughs> Can you feel this energy? Crazy. You know that. Crazy people have no clue what they're doing. I'm perfectly safe. I just do whatever makes me feel alive. You're a fucking psycho. Good roots and all bad sons. Mom? Pa? Being brave, child. See how brave you are. Make it. Either auntie. 
Oh, he will help. Are you okay? Yes. He will be so proud of you. Your courage that night and what you did to save me. I have so much to thank you for. Meg? Go on. Go to your sister. Okay. I love you. Love you. Doing. Right, so I've decided I'm going to paint the ceiling in Dad's study because it needs it. But I'm not sure whether to use emulsion or gloss. I don't know. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, the Wi Fi is gone, so I can't look it up. Oh, that's weird. I thought the signal was back. Yeah, it were, but it's gone again. Might be some like faulty wiring or something. Oh, have you even like read the cans properly? Because I know what you like. Yeah. Well, yeah, <laughs> obviously, you dick. <laughs> I don't know, maybe emulsion or something. Mm, yeah. Yeah, because, I mean, gloss is shiny, so do you want shiny walls? <laughs> shiny! I'll go get my brush and I'll help you. Okay, cool. Right, I'll go with this one then. Research into the lightning storm which struck a few months ago is still ongoing. Dr. Meta addressed the summit yesterday with his theory of electrical charge frequency within the far north of Iceland, in largely uninhibited areas, these storms have been more frequent. What my research has suggested is that a particular charge of lightning is drawn to the small electrical charge found within mammals. Like most storms, the striking points are random, but during flurries of lightning, the energy within the storm begins to hone in to particular striking points. These can be satellites, electricity pylons, but, as we have found, mammals too. This would account for the significant loss of life in the last storm. Dr. Becker 
had correctly predicted the last storm, the power of which was unprecedented, and which the weather services denied. With a lightning storm due to come across the east of England this afternoon and evening, Dr. Becker has made the same warning. We'll have more but the head office has issued an only amber alert so far. In other news, the Prime Minister has come un- again, alleged ties to Russian Mafia. back.